What's going on YouTube? This is Mixtape. Hey, if you're new, like, comment, subscribe, share, all that good stuff. Anyway, man, I got a few good games of 2v2 at my park. And so, you guys will definitely enjoy that. And I'm going to go ahead and get into the gameplay. Remember, subscribe, like, comment, share this, and let me know what y'all want to see as far as 2K20 goes. All right. Appreciate you guys for watching and supporting. Peace. All right, y'all. So I found a game. It took a minute to find this game, but after I found it, you know, we went ahead and did the little introductions and we started. And I noticed that my teammate wasn't the greatest. He was only an 80 overall, so I know that he was probably going to be passing me the ball a lot. So whenever I kind of figured that out, I just wanted to keep my spacing. As you've seen in the first play, I just went ahead and, you know, caught an open position and tried to stay open. I missed the second shot, but right here I greened it. And with the green, I was like, okay, cool. I found my shot, and let's just try and, you know, stay spaced just in case he does try and pass me the ball. So right here we're just – chilling and I seen he tried to make a move and so give him his space to create whenever he wants to that was a bad cut by me and they attacking him cause he's not the best give him a pass oh he gave me a good pass and I think I, yeah, I cashed in right here so at this point I know I'm starting to heat up so now I'm definitely going to be Moving a lot more, trying to get open. Just in case he gives me the ball. Oh, another green, so I'm hot now. Almost filled up the takeover bar. Now I'm real aggressive. That gave me back the ball. Just wanted to make something happen. Got him. Dunk. Okay. So now, as you see, the defender's playing close. Wanted to give him some points. That way he can, you know, feel as I ain't ball hogging. I'm hot. I got my, got my sharpshooter badge on. Got a nice little crossover. I knew he was going to stay right there just because I've been shooting and I got the badge. So he wasn't going to do nothing. It was kind of just to freeze him. Teammate instantly gives me back the ball. Gave me a nice pick. Then they found me. I was finna try and go ahead and pull it back some and create something else. We pass it into him. See what he does. Try and make a play. Give him the ball. He didn't want to shoot. Okay, now he did shoot, so that was good. Try and make him feel comfortable. You know, you don't want a ball hog, even if you're hot. You know, you want to make your teammate feel like he's useful offensively because that'll help him defensively too. When he took that shot, I was like, wow, you know. I know you're trying, but that wasn't the best shot. So I'm just like, okay, let's just be cool. Only three points. Let's make a quick stop. When they gave him back the ball, I was like, oh, okay. He made his shot, so I wasn't really tripping. I was like, hey, we got time. Play good defense, play good defense. Got the good steal, and then he fouled, so I'm still hot. I know all I need is a good open shot, and it's going to be cash. Just about getting open. Well, they double team. We get the green light, and that's game. All right, so in this game, this was a good one, too. I got a decent teammate. He kind of let me do my thing, and it came out good. We got the dub, which is always good, but it's all about spacing to me. You know, you could have a good teammate. By the way, both of those teammates is randoms, 
but you can have good teammates that you could pick up off the you know off the side it's just about spacing spacing and being able to make shots whenever they're needed you know I did a terrible play to start the game off and that's what gave them the ball now I'm being a little bit extra aggressive on the reach so I need to calm down really just let them create and do what they want to that was a good move by my teammate getting the steal and the finish. So now we're up, kind of making up for my bad start. So, okay, so I see that he's just staying back. So I was like, okay, let's give my teammate a shot. Even if he missed, we in good condition. Okay, he get the, he get the shot. My defender is playing zone, so I noticed that, so. It was either a shot or a dunk right there, and I chose the dunk. Get the short points. We have 4 0. Teammate made a good cut. He got the bucket. Now we have 6 0. And at this point, I'm just like, okay, let's just see what the teammate can do. Is he going to be able to kind of take over? And he's showing me that he can, so. It's like, okay, I don't have to really worry about getting open that much because I know he can take his defender off the dribble. So, he didn't see me right there, but that would have been a good pass. I could kind of see that my defender is smart because he likes to play sort of in the passing lanes and catch the rebounds. Seeing that my teammate wasn't really passing that heavy. So, I can't be mad at what he did. Got a good steal there on their end. He blows his shot. Fouls me. So, I'm like, okay, cool. That'll kind of clear it and we can get the ball out. See if he pass it. Okay, good zone. I shouldn't have took that shot either. That was just a bad shot all the way around. I could have either just took the catch and shoot or just kicked it out. It was wide open. My defender did a bad shot too. My other teammate played great defense this whole game, let's be honest. He really didn't let his person do much, and he helped me out a lot. If I had a faster dude, I could have drove. He's giving me the shot, so I might as well take it. Now we have 13-0. Okay, see, he's playing the passing lanes good. So, to me, it's about my teammate just kind of seeing when I'm open and letting us connect the dots from there. Kind of step back. Just trying to create some type of space that he's not used to. He's playing good defense, though, so I can't knock him for that. So, here we go. He's leaving me wide open. I'm just catch and shoot that. Oh, no, I ain't pump fake or nothing. 15. Just kind of create space. He rewards me with it, and then I just go ahead and get the layup. I got four more points, 17-0. I know my defender's going to give me space. He don't want me to score as far as a driving game. So I got the easy assist, so now we're up 20-0, and I'm like, okay, let's just see who ends this off. Uh, let's see, he's just in the passing lanes, playing it smart and safe. But I know he can't shoot. Oh, that's why I was giving him space. So he got his drive in dunk. Good good play. That was my bad. I should have stepped up rather than stepping back. Expecting him to pass. So like I'm trying to give him some type of pick and roll, but I fouled him. Really need to calm down on the reaching sometimes. But it's almost game, so. Good defensive help. Give it to him. And he ends it off. 
So, I mean, I didn't have to score that much to be effective and help my guy out, but it was still a good game. So, if you guys like that, comment, subscribe, share, like the video, and let me know what you guys see. Hopefully, you guys learned a little bit or whatever the case may be. Again, this is Mixtape. Thank you guys for watching it with me. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.